Hello everyone, I've just finished work for the day and this evening I'm going to head over to Wormsley Sanctuary to do some bird watching and of course possibly some other wildlife watching depending on what's around. So there are three hides at Wormsley and I've been to two of them so far and tonight I'm planning to hopefully go to the Tower Hide, which I haven't yet been to. The Tower Hide and the Middle Marsh Hide are members only hides and there is also a public hide at Wormsley. So I'm going to pack up my camera equipment and get going. <laughs> So I've just parked in the lay-by that you park in to access the tower hide and the public hide here at Wormsley and now I'm walking across the fields to get to the tower hide. see what I see. I'm heading back to the tower hide. It was raining on the way over here, but it's stopped now and it's actually brightened up a bit.
far now and just flew right past the hide window and it was illuminated by the golden sun. The sun was literally at its most golden and it was a couple of feet away from me and it was absolutely stunning to see and so close and in so much detail. It was really, really beautiful experience. <laughs> It was dark when I left the hide so I couldn't finish off the video but I wanted to just quickly talk to camera about the two hours that I saw whilst I was visiting the tower hide. Seeing the barn owl both nights was really incredible. It was quite fast so I've tried to slow down some of the footage and you can see there a little bit that I was struggling with the focus and kind of keeping up with the focus as I was tracking the barn owl but it was such a lovely experience that I wanted to share the footage anyway. As for the long-eared owl, I've never seen one before in the wild, so that was a really amazing experience. I wouldn't have actually seen it if it wasn't for my night vision binoculars. So it had gone dark and I took out my binoculars just to have a final look around the area before heading back to the car and I saw a dark shape fly past the hide. I followed it with binoculars and it landed on the post so I switched to my camera, turned the ISO right up, zoomed right in and got the footage. And of course it's very grainy and when the owl flies off, it almost looks like it's dissolving into the night, but still a great experience to actually see one at the sanctuary. So I hope you enjoyed visiting the Tower Hide with me for two consecutive nights. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please do support my channel by liking, subscribing and clicking on the notification bell and I will see you in the next video.